Let us now look at our pipeline of projects. I'm delighted to welcome Mr. Bernd Schramm, our group COO at Amac Aerospace. Bernd, we saw huge challenges during COVID with relations to employment, work patterns, and most importantly, supply chain logistics. How do we fare today with our supply chain issues? Hi, Walid. I come to your question in a minute, but since uh, this year's video session falls together with the EAT, I would like to start and wish a happy EAT to the related community and happy to come back to your question. The, glo the global supply chains are still strained. Some parts need longer lead, uh, longer lead time, need more time to order, material planning is more in the focus than it was before and project schedules for maintenance and completion project had to be adapted to advance material and equipment orders to an earlier stage. Besides the ongoing developments with Boeing, how do you see our relationships with other OEMs such as Pilatus, Bombardier, Gulfstream, Dassault and Airbus? We are proud to say that we have good relationship with all the OEMs that we support, you named them. Uh, the first half of 2023, uh, we returned, for example, two green completion, a BBJ and an Airbus. We work, we have heavy maintenance, modification, interior refurbishment uh, project on Gulfstream, Bombardier, all the OEMs we support. And we believe that they value our services quite high. The 747s have ceased production. What's the next best product that complements Amac's craftsmanship in large cabins from a Boeing point of view? Correct, certain aircraft left the scene, like the Boeing 747, the A380, the big ones. They will be followed by new technology models, A350, Boeing 777X, Boeing 787, new challenges, new technology, new materials. We are looking forward to work on them and we work on them already. We have an A350 under completion right now. Nevertheless, the 747s, especially the 747-8, are still a big part of our operation. Uh, for example, last year we had five Boeing 747-8 simultaneously at our facility undergoing maintenance modification. So we keep a strong relation to the existing 747 customers that we have. Can you highlight any new engineering solutions that are taking place out of Amac Aerospace Basel, please? As you know, Walid, each modification completion project requires new certification, new EASA, FAA, STC certification. So every project is, is unique. And to highlight um, elements where we have separate single STCs, I would like to mention the KA band installation, where we hold more than 15 STCs on different aircraft models right now. There is a wireless charging systems where we develop separate STCs. We develop special certification plans for our in-house um, honeycomb carbon fiber phenolic panels, our in-house floorboards that we design with our sister company in, in France, to name a few. But as said, every project requires new development, new STC certification. Bodrum's doing really well with their uptake on MRO activities. Can you explain why this is occurring and how we're dealing with multiple inquiries? We are very happy with our facility in Bodrum. After five years, it became a significant and major player within the group. It is a very active place for airline, but also VIP aircraft maintenance, maybe a little bit more focus on the airline maintenance and its location, its attractive commercial conditions combined with the reputation and the quality of AMAC made it a facility which is constantly growing and we and plans to build further hangars are approved by the management. 
JCB are vigorous in their R&D and their manifestations of new materials to the new marketplace. Can you therefore highlight some of these new products that JCB are developing? Yeah. Our French sister company in Auch, between Toulouse and Bordeaux, not easy to find, <laughs> of a state-of-the-art factory. They produce for the aviation sector, for OEMs, for airlines, seat manufacturer, as well as uh, the maritime sector. JCB is also developing and manufacturing a range of honeycomb panels for us that we use for the interior build-up. They received an EASA approval for new type of floorboards and JCB is also proud to have been awarded a contract for first class seat dividers and surround for one of the major airlines in the world. Gamut have shown face at many local, regional and inter-regional shows since being incorporated into our group of companies. Can you summarize what Rome is and how they wish to push this service further into the marketplace? Gamut has two important roles for us. One role is to support us with the parts supply, especially in these times where it became a major, a major and important factor to be successful. But they also developed and offer a system called Roam, which stands for Records Online Asset Management, which uses advanced technologies to deliver the most effective and user-friendly document management solution available in the aerospace industry today. Gamut is talking to a large number of operators and at present and well as being in the final stages of discussions with two well-known airlines to support them with the digital document solution they have to offer. And what shows will the company be attending this year and can you highlight the reasons for attending MBAA in Las Vegas in 2023, please? We had quite a bit of internal discussions about shows, exhibitions in general, especially since the last two, three years. We could not participate in any. We were analyzing the effect of not participating in, in shows. And at the end, we said it's still an important place to be, to connect, with the industry, to meet people, and therefore we decided to continue, be present at shows, and for the first time in our history, we will also be exhibitor at the NBAA in the US, where we were visitors before, but never exhibitors, and along with the NBA, we will maintain our presence at the um, main shows that we used to be before, like the MIBA, the eBay's, um, in the Hamburg interior air shows, and um, the one or the other in addition. Thank you very much for your answers today, Bern. You're welcome, Malit. For now, we thank you for watching. We look forward to meeting you again in person soon or at eBay's. But until then, stay safe, everyone. Thank you.